The Nexus Social Club used to be our practice court prior to renovation. So when we have those members that have been with us for a long period of time, it's great to have those conversations with them and them say, hey, you know, how cool is this? I came in new here just a year and a half ago, so I saw the finished product, but I was really wowed by our Nexus Social Club. I think that's our kind of jewel of the arena and just from the special smell we pipe in to the look and feel of that space. Now with the enhanced food and beverage, we are activating the Nexus Social Club year round now, so it will be open during Mercury Games. We're gonna be opening it on select concert nights. With the new ownership group, like they're all about creating new vibrant um, premium spaces. So the uh, coolest one that we've just started is this place called M Club. So we actually took a place that was on our uh, B-level suite area. It was pretty much three suites combined into one. So annually on a typical year, we only sold it as a rental and we were able to garner about 750K a year from this suite space, just renting it on a one-off. So this year we took that piece of real estate, found out we can monetize it better and create a premium club. And we now have announced and, and introduced it as the M Club this year, which is going to garner over $2 million in reoccurring revenue. And it actually goes towards our lease bucket as well, because it's inclusive of Suns, Mercury and any arena concerts throughout the year. We sell out of all of our season tickets. We sell out of court sides and most of our premium spaces. So to be able to create uh, another premium space that can replicate the same experience in regards to f and in regards to um, high upscale atmosphere, as well as a premium kind of experience with privacy. The M Club has been an ultimate second offering other premium areas that I'm proud of are our Nexus Social Club. It's our row A and row B uh, members here at the arena. So what we've created inside that place is two different things is we took kind of a dead space inside that club and created what we call the wine library. So we took feedback from our top members who sit in those spaces and wine had came up multiple times. We partnered with some different people locally and created a wine library and a wine club inside the space where members were able to pay a premium to get inside of it and taste some of the most high scale wines um, across the country here at the arena. And that's been a huge space that, again, garnered a, a good amount of a six-figure revenue for us. The premium space that I am the most proud of is the Nexus Social Club. Having just an exclusive space like that for only our row A and B members is, is pretty great. We even introduced an icon pass that you could purchase if you are not a row A or B member that would gain you access to that club. Um, so the need and want to be there is so real. It has great history as well. The Nexus Social Club used to be our practice court prior to renovation. So when we have those members that have been with us for a long period of time, it's great to have those conversations with them and them say, hey, you know, how cool is this? that this used to be our practice court. Now this has become the most exclusive club. But I also love our suite levels and we have some open bars. Uh, so the Jim Beam Barrel Bar is on our suite level A. It's premium, but also has a little bit of element that's open to everyone, provides a great view. And so I think we have some uniquely used spaces here that I'm really proud of. I think my favorite spot for like viewpoint and photos is probably one of our corner bars, the Hornitos Corner Bar, right off our main pavilion when you walk in and looks directly out over the court. And that's such a, just a great visual, a wow moment. My favorite space would have to be probably the Ultra Club because I can can pop out of the Ultra Club and I can look right courtside and, and see what's going on on the court, which is great to be able to look up in the entire arena and see, you know, all 17,000 plus people that are here to support us. That's a really good enjoy the moment, which is part of our Valley Pride. The E in Valley Pride is enjoy the moment. So that is a time when I like to enjoy the moment is to pop out there and really look at everybody and say, wow, I have a really cool job and this is a really cool experience.